welcome, friends, to another exciting episode of A VGM Journey. And I'm your host, The Messenger. The track that we're playing in today's show is Cosmo Plant from the game Gradius 3, and it was composed by Mickey Higashino. We've got another show filled with awesome music, and I just want to get right into it. I want to start things off with a request from Meatbug. He wanted me to play something from Don Pachi. This is The Battle Intensifies, and it was composed by Ryuichi Yabuki. track that you just heard that was the battle intensifies from the game don pachi and it was composed by ryuichi yabuki and it was requested by meatbug so thank you meatbug for that track i'm actually not all that familiar with the game and from my quick research i see that it's one of those bullet hell kind of games where it's a shoot 'em up but the enemies like the fire like ridiculous amount of bullets at you and you're trying to dodge them all and shoot at them and i think that's pretty much what you do in a lot of shoot 'em ups but these ones they like to turn things up to 11 on the intensity and it came out for a few different systems it started off as an arcade game uh this specific version is from the sega saturn and i don't think i've ever played anything from the saturn on the show before so it's always nice to take a dip into new systems and this was at the point in video game music where we were starting to move on from the bleeps and bloops of the 8-bit and 16-bit style music into Redbook Audio, playing a lot of really cool sounding music. Stuff that it was sounding less video gamey and more, I would say, quote unquote, real music. And I think at that point, it seemed like these video game composers, they went from having limited options to, hey, we could pretty much do almost anything that we want to do. And I think around that time, it was really exciting to hear what these game soundtracks are capable of sounding like. This next track is another request, and it's going in a completely different direction. It's a lot more modern, and it's a jam. This is coming from Hammock, the host of KVGM, The Last Wave, and he wants me to play Whoa, I'm in Space Cuba from the game Mighty Switch Force, and that was composed by Jake Kaufman. <laughs> Thank you. 
track that you just heard that was whoa i'm in space cuba from the game mighty switch force it was composed by jake kaufman and it was requested by hammock so thank you hammock for that awesome track i'm actually really surprised that hammock requested this track because on his show kvgm the last wave he plays a lot of chill music and this song is a jam and i've actually kind of dipped my toes in this game a little bit so it's a action platformer puzzle type of deal where where you I'm not sure how to describe it you switch blocks like some blocks will be transparent and others are solid and you like switch back and forth and that's how you maneuver around the stages and this soundtrack and its sequel they're two of my favorite soundtracks ever i mean mighty switch force and mighty switch force 2 both those soundtracks are a jam i mean i've played that silk patrol alpha song from mighty switch force 2 on this show not once but twice because i love that song so much and i think whoa i'm in space cuba might be the best song on the first mighty switch force and Jake Kaufman, that man can do no wrong when it comes to music. Is He's up there with a lot of my favorite composers. So, yeah, I just want to say, once again, thank you for this track, Hammock. And you keep doing an awesome job on your show. I love your show. This next track, it's a little bit of a nostalgic track for me. This is coming from Tiny Toon Adventures, Bab's Big Break. This is Pipes, also known as Stage 2, and it was composed by Hirohiro Funuchi. track that you just heard that was pipes from the game tiny toon adventures bab's big break and it was composed by hirohiro funuachi i think this game and this song is really special to me because it was there in the beginning of my own vgm journey so i was born in 94 1994 and i want to say i started playing games in 97 98 and I had an original Game Boy and a, a few games. There was Game & Watch Gallery, there was Donkey Kong Land 2, and then there was this game, Tiny Toon Adventures Bab's Big Break. So I played those three games a ridiculous amount of times, and, and this was a track that stood out to me at the time. I mean, it's nothing special to look at now, but on a personal level, this track's got a lot of meaning. And I guess, you know, just listen to it now, it's a pretty nice jazzy sounding kind of track. I don't know if jazzy is the right word, but that's what it makes me think of. And the game itself, it's not bad. I think it's on the slower side. So I feel like your characters kind of play like they're on molasses and that the jumps are a bit floaty. And a lot of the music is made up of arrangements. I mean, you, there's the Tiny Toon Adventures theme and some classical pieces of music. And I believe that this is one of a few tracks that are an original piece. So that's why I picked this one. Moving on, I got a really great final boss song for you guys. This is coming from Rayman 2. This is Final Battle, and it was composed by Eric Chevalier. <laughs>
rocking track you just heard. That was Final Battle from the game Rayman 2, and it was composed by Eric Chevalier. That's going to just about do it for the show this week. If you like what you've been listening to, have your friends check out the show on Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, Spotify, Stitcher, whatever podcatching service that you can think of, I'm more than likely going to be on there. You can email the show at vgmjourney at yahoo.com and also check us out on Twitter at vgmjourney. We have a really nice Discord server as well. I will throw a link for it in the show notes and you can just hang out with pretty awesome people talking about the show or talking about video game music and even look at and share some nice art. We're going to play out with one more song. It is Setting Out the staff roll theme from Elemental Master, and it was composed by Tashihiro Yamanishi. Have a good week, everyone.